Well, he was a rising star in Detroit's rap community and starting to get some national attention as well. Aaron Mays, better known as Jizzle P, was shot and killed last night while sitting in a car on Detroit's west side. Defender Sean Lay spoke to his mother today, and Sean joins us live with more. Sean? Just a difficult conversation. You're talking about Aaron Mays, the son and loved by so many in his family and neighborhood. Then Jizzle P, uh, his nickname as a rapper, packed with talent. Really a star on the rise. His mom tells me she was right there when someone ran up and shot him to death. My hey. heart don't hurt, my soul hurt. Perfect. My he soul perfect hurt. He was perfect I watched me. my son die my face. Can you imagine watching your own son die? Seneca Mays walked out of her home on Detroit's West Side at 8.15 last night. Her son, 25-year-old Aaron Mays, was sitting in a car, the two of them cracking jokes. When someone ran up, firing so many shots at Mays, his mother says she couldn't see the suspect's face. There was so much muzzle flash from the gun. I couldn't see his face at all. The fire from the gun, it was just too... Remember hitting the road day and night, taking long trips. Aaron Mays was well known in Detroit, a rising star in the rap industry known as Jizzle P. Kenny Valentino with Hot 1075 says when someone like Jizzle P works hard and starts to make it and then is targeted like this, it hurts the young people that look up to him. It's very motivating to our young people to see someone from your neighborhood someone who may be from a few blocks or a few miles away from you begin to make it and then they're gunned down. It's very sad. And I will say this, I'm, I'm gonna be strong for him. All the time. Yes, ma'am. Guess why? Yes, ma'am. That's a fact. He don't want me to cry. He don't want me to mourn. My brother was too and he strong. don't want to be on a t-shirt. Absolutely devastating for this family, for the thousands of fans that really enjoy Jizzle P's uh, music. Bottom line here, another family member also hit by that gunfire in critical condition right now. Motive and the gunman uh, still under investigation by Detroit Homicide. We're live tonight. Sean Lay, local for Defenders. Okay, Sean, thanks.